I gotta get it, yeah Already winning and this is just the beginning Uh, I'm a menace in this game and I replenish it And these niggas that's in the game, boy they finish Competition, I'm abolishing Straight to my What's good, y'all? Just came from practice, but I had to stop over and get the Lambo. A little touch up on the Lambo, you feel me? But I'm on the way back to the crib, you know, after this crucial practice. And, you know, I'm taking back streets and shit. I'm bumbling and fuck this out. Let me go to this GPS. See where the fuck this house at, man. I don't I'm used to taking this motherfucker away. But anyway, um, we up. 2 1 on the um, Los Angeles Lakers, and I'm feeling like a feeling like a boss right now because I've been helping hold my city down, holding Washington down, man. Leaving this nigga Kobe mad as hell after every motherfucking game, pissed off at me. And oh shit, I almost fucking passed my damn turn and shit. But anyway, um, but yeah, I just can't wait to get in this house and try to get some motherfucking rest because the game tomorrow. Still here in Washington. Yeah, we got our last two games in Washington, so we could probably close this bitch out here, man. I, I would love to win a championship at my home building, but anyway. I'm going upstairs to just try to get some motherfucking rest. What do I want to do? Do I want to go in the room? Do I want to lay down here on the couch watching? Nah, I just go in the motherfucking room. See what's up in here. Lay down and shit. No, got some motherfucking hoes in this bitch, huh? Hmm, what do I want to do? Watch Sports Center, fuck some hoes. Watch Sports Center, fuck some hoes. Watch Sports Center, fuck some hoes. Ah, look like I'm gonna be fucking some hoes tonight, man. Hell yeah, bro. But, um, yeah, holla at me, um. Game about to start. And I know they haven't gotten ahead of themselves, but they can't help thinking about the opportunity that sits before them. Yeah, guys, they, they win this one, and they've got a very realistic chance of closing this series out at home in Game 5. They would much prefer that than they have to go on the road again. So it was good, yo. I'm back. And it's my fucking quarter. You see what Moe Sessions holding on to that ball. He throw it around to Kobe. You already know how Kobe get down when he wide open. So I ain't even got to discuss that no more. You see this nigga Ramon Sessions run this fast break. Get a gay layup. And now Paul Gasol trying to do something. John Wall smack that shit out the building. And we trying to run this fast break after John Wall almost lose the damn ball. I'm running up. He giving that hold of me. Better be. I get that hold of me. And I get right past him and gets the slam of the night. Hopefully that's the slam of the night. Because I'm just, I just was going ham on these niggas lately. Just dunking on everybody on the Lakers lately. But whatever. Kobe pulling up. And you already know how this nigga do. This nigga Kobe is unstoppable in this game. Look at that pass from John Wall. Going up with that patented leaner. Getting buckets, holding my team down, man. Every every step of the way. You can see this dude Ramon Sessions crossing over, and then he think he Kobe. Once he get into the lane, finish him with all types of crazy moves. You know, we're trying to, trying to hold this lead, and right now it's like a close. Oh! <laughs> this dude Kobe, this baby, to stop my sentence. Wow. But yeah, what I was saying, it's like a low scoring game, and look at Ramon Sessions. Oh! <laughs> It's getting real out here. Oh, it's getting real. Oh yeah, that's that's the way I like it too. I like it. I like it nice and real. People getting dunked on, getting slapped to the ground, all types of junk like that, bro. That be, that that's when you know it's a real game out here. You feel me? But um, they coming down and look at this dude. They get the slam. And they take the lead. And like I was trying to say before, it's a low scoring game. And these niggas ain't trying to give up. And look at Trevor Booker getting the and one and giving me an assist. So shout out to Trev Booker for that one, right? <laughs> oh man, but going to this free throw line. I want y'all to pay attention to what's about to happen. 
So Booker goes up, missed the free throw, but blocks get it and put it right back. So that's hustle right there. When you, let me know when your teammates start hustling like my teammates, and then we can talk. You feel me? Look at John Wall coming down, crossing over again straight to the rack for a layup. Matt Barnes think he doing something, but get that shit out of here, nigga. On that fast break, you know what time it is, my nigga. It's air time with the reverse slam. Ah, shit is getting real in Washington. Shit is getting real in Washington. Can I take a page out of IKC book and call this bitch Dunkington? Because we've been dunking like a motherfucker out of this bitch. And I, oh, look, too, I said dunk. Shit get real. I wasn't even looking at the screen. I happened to look up and see this bitch ass nigga getting dunked on. God damn. And look, you know, I'm going to the line for these free throws. And I finally f switched my free throw release. I got my correct one back. And I still don't get perfect release. <laughs> I still don't get perfect release, but I still make the motherfucking free throw. That's all that matters. And I see Blatcher running up the court, so I get him the ball, and he gets a layup. And I just say that all together, like I'm talking like this, and then blah, 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 blah. And look at this nigga Bynum getting layups because he's a bitch. And look at they running one of my favorite plays. Let's see what's going to happen. You know what happened when they run my favorite plays. I come around screens, make it scream, and get buckets. I love feeling good. I love feeling. Look at this. Look at Lene hanging all in the air for that layup, knowing he had to do all that shit. You feel me? And I almost get Jay by running our tests. They get the rebound back and they put it back. That's one thing we got to work on, though, is offensive of rebounding. Cause these niggas be killing us on those goddamn boards. But they running my other favorite play. I you know this one looking like I come around that screen and get the tough layup to drop. And I'm feeling like a beast right now. Shot clock winding down. You know who they go to? They go to me to get the buckets. Let's get into this half, man. Welcome to game four of the NBA Finals, basketball's biggest stage. Now let's get you to the HP halftime report. Washington leading against the Lakers. They're up big early and vying for a 3-1 lead in the NBA Finals. Andre Bloch has been doing his thing. He's got a dozen points and the looks have been coming for him. A great shooting percentage from the floor and the line. There's no quitting the Lakers. They came to win. Garbage points making up the difference, and right now they're sweeping the streets. A good start for Kobe. After two, he's got ten points and has also been able to collect six rebounds as well. Not the closest game, but you got to hand it to both of these guys for setting the pace. And with that, we'll wrap things up. All right, coming into the second half, we already know what we got to do. We got to try to come out here and try to close these dudes out. But it's not looking that way. As you can see, these boys are just trying to run wild on us. Kobe back to back. Cherry picks. And oh, my God, look at that dunk. I didn't even know that boy could still dunk like that. Now, that's crazy. Yeah, that's us. I like I like that dunk. I just ain't going to hate on this nigga tonight. I ain't going to hate on this nigga Kobe tonight. But he throwing up that three. He missed, but they get the goddamn rebound back and put it back up. We got to stop them from doing that if we want to win this motherfucking game. But my boy John Wall coming through for us in this third quarter. I mean, he was a big part of this third quarter. Whenever I got stopped, I just gave it off to John Wall, and he went up and got some buckets. He's the only reason why this game was even still close in this third quarter because they started running them up on us. Look at Andrew Bynum spinning off Nene and getting a slam dunk. Like it's nothing, like Nene wasn't even right there or something. But you see John Wall hitting another step back and getting a bucket again. That's why I fucks with that nigga. That's why I call him my Russell Westbrook because when KD not on, Russell Westbrook comes through. Just like when I'm not on, my boy John Wall coming through. I give him the ball again and he gets the fade away bucket to drop. It's like... It's like they they can't they can't find the leash that go on this nigga. But in the fourth quarter, I mean, let me do something because I didn't score that whole third quarter. I just run around, knock down that three, come back. They giving the ball to me. I go up and I get the motherfucking dunk. And I'm out here trying to do something for my team. I want to close this game out. I want to win. That's all I see in my eyes is winning. And look at Kobe throwing up the alley oop. You already know they gonna slam that one down to the ground, boy. Look at me, I got this boy Meta on me, and I'm just pulling up. Fuck Meta World Peace. I swear I dare him to throw a motherfucking elbow, though. I'll bust his ass. Look at that nigga. Oh, look at the nigga. Got the spin move, got the mellow spin popping. And they call it my favorite play. You already know how I get down with this. Oh, shit. This nigga the name. What the fuck, nigga? And now I get taken out the game for this nigga setting the fucking illegal. What the How the fuck do that work? But I'm just praying my team don't get fucking smoked while I'm not in the game. And the exact opposite happens. 
So when I come in this bitch, we already like almost got the win basically. But Kobe throwing the ball up in two people's face. You already know how the Kobe get down. You already know how this nigga get down down in the clutch. They like giving the ball back to this nigga. He hustling, got an A on him. He goes to the rim and he miss. Wow, that's not like Kobe missing down the down the stretch. Again, they going back to Kobe. He throwing it up and he miss again. What the hell? Is that really Kobe? Look at this nigga in the name, but look at Blotch getting the put back slam. The clutchest motherfucking dunk of the night. God damn. If it wasn't for this nigga right here. I don't know. Maybe we probably maybe he's still with a one. But I know this nigga ensured I'll win. And then they get a ball to Ramon Session and say, fuck Kobe, that nigga ass. And then Ramon Session just ass hurting him. I tried to haul ass, they foul me and shit. They they they, they catch a nigga. Feel me? All niggas can't get away and shit. But I go to the free throw line. I made the first one. And getting ready for the second one. Still not perfect release, but perfect enough. And I get that free throw to fall too. So this time they give it to Kobe. He shoots it up. He gets the bucket, but it might be a little bit too motherfucking late, Kobe. Might be too late, because they're giving the ball to me, and I'm trying to haul ass again. I get away a little bit, they still foul me, and I knock down both free throws, and this game is over. The Washington Wizards take a 3-1 lead in the NBA Finals, and I'm looking forward to seeing y'all again in Game 5 here in Washington. Look out for it. Real niggas stay up. I'm out. Fuck you think. Watch my money getting bigger while y'all money stinking. And I'm smoking on some shit that got the room stinking. Call it the dower. Trying to get money and power. That's why I'm killing everything a young nigga devour. Catch me stunting in public like it ain't nothing. Bad bitches and if they ain't fucking, they keep it trucking. Yeah. Steady chasing paper, but the paper ain't running. Swag ill, got these bitches sick and so they stung. Yeah, I hear them haters talking, but it don't mean nothing. Niggas say they getting money when they seen nothing. M-O-E, M-O-E, M-O-E. Yeah, bitches money over Really impressive game from you tonight. It seemed like you could do no wrong. What are your thoughts on the game and how you played? It was a great team effort, really. We did a nice job executing on both offense and defense. And when you see your teammates playing so well, it automatically elevates your own game. I think that's what happened with me tonight. I was just caught up in the flow, and not only did we get to win, but it showed in my individual game, too.